Saturday's contest marked the second time the Rebels and the Tigers squared off as SEC foes, and for the first time in Como. Hey, hey, it's cold, so you know we got a lot of ice on. Um, it's a little bit colder than it was in Oxford when we left, but we're looking to bring the heat tonight. Stay tuned. What are you going to do today, Dad? You're going to kick bombs. You're going to kick bombs. Let me snap bombs, bombs. Big hits. Holds are going to be laces out. Kicks are going to be long and far. It's all you can ask for from the special teams group. Brown wasted little time to light the explosives. As Mac Brown punts it away, the returner and slot receiver Jonathan Johnson who muffs it. And Ole Miss is on the football. Let's go! Let's go! That's our ball! That's our ball! Let's go! Let's go! Stay within the system. BJR tonight. BJR. Looks downfield. He's going to turn and run to the near side. He gets to the 20, lowers his head, dives for the first down. He didn't slide. He went head first, and John Rice gets the first down to the 18-yard line. Woo! me, baby! Yes, sir! Plumley, end zone, touchdown, Scotty Phillips. Yeah! Down the near sidelines, he laid it right in there, and Phillip broke clear. Easy toss and catch, and the Rebels strike first. Veteran QB Kelly Bryant didn't take kindly to the Rebels crashing the homecoming affair. Bryant wings it out to the sideline. Beautiful ball to Johnson, and a Mizzou first down. How's that for the running quarterback, huh? That's a beautiful throw on that corner route. For Mizzou, and this is good. Bryant to throw, pressure around the corner. That's a dagger down the middle for Johnson. And a first down, Mizzou. They bring five, and Bryant down the middle has a first down for Johnson in that slot rod. That's an automatic. You've got to go to him. Little juggle on the snap. He throws the screen. And a catch and run for Beatty. Down the sideline, Tyler Beatty, touchdown. Kind of a late developing screen left, and Beatty takes it to the house, and Missouri takes the lead. With the Tigers finding their way on offense, the black and gold showed why they're among the elite defending the run. Looking to turn the momentum, the Rebs called on gunslinger Matt Corral. Matt Corral comes in to play quarterback. They throw it on his first play, and he's on target across the 35-yard line to Drummond for a first down. First down! First down! Yes, sir! Yes, sir! I want to about two! Down the middle, Corral has it to Moore, and Elijah Moore wrestles his way across the 30. There's the snap. Corral throws, crossing route, caught at the 10-yard line and tackled there. Up and that's a strike for Moore one more time. Yep. First down. Yes, sir! Great catch! Connor dancing inside the five and clubbed down for a second and goal. Trey Williams straight up the gut for Connor down to the one. Great drive for Corral. One more run right to the doorstep and shoved back. No, he's not in. Connor is short. It's fourth down and goal. Hey, we got him where we want. Let's finish. We got him where we want. Let's finish. Snew Connor, the freshman, a 215-pounder. He's in. Trips in the wide receivers. Fourth and goal. They'll run it straight ahead. And... Mizzou holds. Trey Williams got into Connor. What a stop on homecoming. That's a touchdown. That's a touchdown, Lee. What do you see? I see the ball getting close to that goal line. You just need the point of the ball over the goal line here. The ball is right there. Yeah. But from that angle, I get obscured by the lineman before he's pushed back. After review, the ruling on the field stands. Yep. The ball goes over. First down, Missouri. The stop meant the host took the ever so important momentum into the break. And they tightened their grip when they took the field for the second half. The handoffs to Roundtree working the right side, runs into traffic, now comes back to the middle of the field, the 45, the 40. 
and tackled there. There's the snap, and the handoff's to Roundtree. He's got the first down and more. Breaks clear at the 20. He'll take it to the house. Touchdown, Mizzou. Too much time, fires down the near side. He's got a man wide open, caught it to 40, to the 30, to the 25, to the 20-yard line is Tyler Beatty. Wheel route out of the backfield, and Beatty wide open. Goes off right tackle, breaks in the clear of the 40, to the 30, he's to the 20, to the sidelines, hit, and reaches for the goal line, and he made it. Well, Ole Miss struck like this against Vanderbilt last week. Missouri's returning the favor to the Ole Miss defense this week. The scrappy young group of Rebels has fought for the full 60 minutes each time out. Coach Matt Luke will never allow that to change. We're getting a stop right here. Let's go get two scores and win this game. Let's go. Right? Me and you Don't keep leading. Me and you. Let's go. Let's go. Over the middle, doesn't see anything. Runs left and a lot of green pasture. He gets to the 35, the 40, slows up and steps out of bounds around the 47-yard line. Got a tight end right as well. There's the snap. Looking to throw toward the end zone. He's got Elijah Moore, and Moore's going to snag it out of the air. Touchdown, Ole Miss. That particular throw by John Rice was sweet. That was a good throw. And he stays inside, so there's plenty of room for Plumlee to drop that ball. And what a great throw. Nice catch. He goes down the sideline anyway, and what an adjustment from Demarcus Gregory. My, oh, my. Tremendous over-the-shoulder catch. Good throw, putting the ball up, giving your receiver a chance. Look at that. Great over-the-shoulder. And this was the moment they saw single coverage out there, they just went right after it. Second down eight from the nine-yard line. There's the snap to Plumlee. He fakes left. He's going to run straight up the middle of the five. He's in the end zone. Touchdown, Ole Miss. Ole Miss is hanging around here over 13 minutes to go. It's a long 13 minutes. It's going to be that much sweeter, man. If you keep fighting, it'll be that much sweeter. Don't let up. Don't let the details slip. He voids it now, turns and runs, fakes a pass, runs down the field. He could go. He's 20, 10, 5, touchdown, Ole Miss. He can motor. He is so decisive. Watch when he makes up his mind. He's right there. He's like, I'm out of here. In the end. The Tigers' early scores prove to be too much, and they leave the party victorious. He takes the knee, the clock will run out, and Missouri is going to win this one, 38 to 27. Come on, bring her tight. When you come on the road in the Southeastern Conference, you gotta, you gotta play, you gotta play good football. We didn't play well enough to win tonight. The attention to detail, the little things that it takes to win games. We left too many points on the field. Holding penalty, not scoring on fourth down, not getting off the field in the third quarter. You have to do all those things to come on the road and win football games. Do you understand me? Hey, but listen, there, we don't, we, there is no option. We'll go back to work tomorrow and we'll go take a step forward. We'll get better. Remember, you got three choices, right? <coughs> hey, you can quit, you can cover up, or you can come out swinging, right? You can quit and you throw the towel in and quit. All right, you can cover up, act like you're fighting, but not really fighting, or you come out of the corner swinging. And that's what the hell we're getting ready to do next week. Y'all got what I'm saying? So let's move forward. Did not line up correctly a couple times tonight, which we have been against the exact same sets. So that's the coach's fault. We'll have to coach them harder and better. I mean, at the end of the day, we're, we're on the same team, you know, so we're really trying. We're, we're working. We're in each other's corner all the time. We're competitors, you know, so we, we always want to be on the field, but we want what's, better, what's best for the team uh, most definitely. As I said before, I mean, it might be unconventional, but you know, it's how we do it in practice, and I've done it in the past, and I thought those kids handled it pretty well. Again, but you got to regroup and um, look forward to going back home next week.